Eastern Carolina woman got the chance of a lifetime to show off her knowledge on an episode of Wheel of Fortune that will air this week. Our Alyssa Hefner sat down with her today to learn about the opportunity, and she's live now with the story. Alyssa? Bailey, Sarah Bach works here. Sarah Bach works here at ECU and she watched Wheel of Fortune growing up, but now years later she got the opportunity to spin the wheel for herself. Sarah Bach is an East Carolina University assistant professor of special education. And then I'm going to have you guys do a challenge equation. But she recently traded her classroom for the Wheel of Fortune set. And my mom still watches it every night. And a commercial came on that said, if you want to be a contestant, to go ahead and fill out the application. And I thought, why not? One day in January, she hopped on a plane to head to L.A. for about 24 hours. It didn't really feel like it was actually happening. Um, it was very quick. It was a really quick turnaround. Her students back in Eastern Carolina said they were so excited to find out she was going to be on the game show. I remember coming in the first day of class and she was like, oh yeah, and then I'm also going to be on Wheel of Fortune. We were like, what? Vogue said it still doesn't feel real being on Sajax last season. So it's going to be really exciting to kind of see everything. And meeting Pat Sajak, I mean, hello, he's an icon. While she didn't give much of a sneak peek into our episode and how she did, she said strategy is key. Even though you study and you practice and you practice, it all goes out the window. The minute you get on that stage, those lights go on and that audience starts clapping. Her students will also have to tune in to see the outcome, but they have plenty of faith in her. I think she did amazing. She's a math guru. She teaches us all these amazing little tricks and stuff to give our students. And so I think if she used any of that, she did amazing. In fact, her students are planning to have a watch party for her episode. It's the red, remember all of Falk also told me she wanted this moment to be a teaching experience for her students and to take chances in life because you never know what could happen. Reporting live in Greenville, Alyssa Hafner, WITN News. Alrighty, thank you, Alyssa. And you can watch her on this Friday's episode that will air right here on WITN at 7 p.m.